NGBN-TV, a network for men in their 40s, 50s, and 60s, coming January 2024. Welcome to the Run Down with Rubio. It is Tuesday. What is it? October 10th, 2023. Here we go. Everything happens for a reason. The Rock has apologized for the Maui fund he set up with Oprah. Yeah, this was a bad PR move. I mean, I understand that he wanted to raise funds for the whole Maui burn issue, you know, major, major fires. But the fact that he came on basically begging with Oprah, asking for money when he has I, I don't know if he's a billionaire, but he's a hundred times over a millionaire. And Oprah, I definitely know is a billionaire. That was just a bad look because if I'm looking at it, I'm saying, how much money are you giving, man? Because that's going to be the big thing. What percentage of your income are you actually giving to these people that you're so adamant about helping? So he got a lot of backlash. That's the reason for it. Uh, there are winners and losers in life. Parents in Seattle, Washington confront a naked man in a JC Penny after he had allegedly attempted to uh, inappropriately touch their children. Good. They should have. This is what happens in a place like Seattle where it's gone so far open and just letting people do what they want that no one can get prosecuted. P the civilians, the, just the normal pedestrians have to take up the law in their own hands. They see this guy. I'm, I have a buddy that lives in Seattle and he was telling me that he was someone walking around his backyard, called the cops. They never even came. So this is what's going to happen more and more and more. Winners and losers in life. The winner was the people that are actually standing up for themselves. Losers are going to be criminals at this point, but they're going to have to be safe out there. Uh, accept and embrace. The 2028 Los Angeles Olympics will have several new sports. Cricket, flag football, baseball, softball, lacrosse, and squash could also be added. Great. I think it's fantastic. I accept and I embrace all of them, especially the flag football, because that's going to open up youth sports a lot. To the olympics uh i remember one time in 84 actually i went to the olympics in los angeles and it was still it's still a moment that i remember so this is just going to open up more and more youth and obviously world things like lacrosse and squash and cricket those are not necessarily just americans so good for them uh working hard is not enough a man dressed in full parachute gear was located at around 12 30 on the grounds of a residence in titusville florida yes the man was dead so he can work as hard as he wants to work on his parachuting or hang gliding or, you know, skydiving. If that parachute doesn't open, you're game over, dude. So that's a that's a rough one. I'm, I'm hoping he kind of knocked himself out or had a heart attack on the way down because if he just splat hit, that's a no bueno. Uh, confidence is the key. <laughs> this one it makes me laugh. Ukrainian President Zelensky says Putin behind Hamas, Hamas attack, attack on Israel. So is everything just going to be blamed on the Russians and Putin at this point? Because I'm pretty sure this one has nothing to do with that at all. But Zelensky, God love you. You have the confidence to keep saying it is. All right. If you have any questions, you can email rubio at therubiomethod.com.